Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Lanye. If this is your first time here, I am glad to have you. Now, my channel is dedicated to motivating, influencing, and inspiring you, and also to make your life to entertain you. I do that in the form of inspirational quotes and comedy videos. Now, this particular video is not for the little kids. It contains graphic language and adult content. So, either you leave the room to get around the little kids, or you put your headphones on. But, Today's video is story time, the day my kids, one of them, had the nerve to bring a cat home. So picture this, beautiful summer day. It's approximately, I say, four o'clock in the afternoon because school's out. So my kids bring this cat home. Oh, mama, look what I got. I said, oh, <laughs> what? A cat? Oh, isn't it cute? I said, where you get that damn cat from? Over there by the school. I said, what the fuck I'm doing with it? I'm going to do what a cat in the 70 yard I can barely feed you. So I made them, my son put get in the car with that cat who went right back around there to where they got the cat from. Literally right on the street in front of the school. So I don't want to abandon animals. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, I literally said a prayer. I'm like, Lord Jesus, you know my heart. I don't want to abandon this animal. But Jesus, I don't want this cat. So I told my kids, take it back. So literally... We took the cat food and water. So literally, the moment we put the cat down, I kid you not, less than a minute, this lady drove up. She said, are you guys abandoning that cat? I said, no, 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 wait a minute. It's not my cat. I don't want you thinking that. I told my kids, take that cat right back over there where you got it from. So she said, oh, I'll take the cat. I said, oh, my God, talk about God answering their prayer that fast. So she took the cat and she took it in the car and she, t and she went home. So we went home, too. So the next day after school, my son came and told me, he said, Mama, guess what? I said, what? He said, do you know that that was one of my classmates' aunt that picked up the cat? So basically the cat got back to his rightful home because I could already tell the cat. He didn't look malnourished. He looked nice, fat, chunky. You know, he was happy, which means he was used to being around people. But anyway, that ended well. And the point of that story is, the power of prayer. God shows up at just the right time and just the right way. And uh, me, I want to let you know, I got a nasty mouth. I got to do me. I'm not trying to be mean or nasty, but hey, either you take me or you don't. This is the authentic me. You know that cursing pastor on Facebook? He might be my next husband. But anyway, thanks for stopping by. I love to entertain you. You know what they say about me? They say, I'm an x-ray tech. Lanye, she don't do a lot of work. But she sure can't entertain you. I do work. Maybe just not at the speed they want me to, but I work. So anyway, if I ever win the lottery, yeah, we may go back around the corner and try to find another cat. But in the meantime, do you know how expensive it is to feed a cat? I can barely feed you. So anyway, story time. Hey, word. Now that story time was when my kids bought a cat home during the day. I got another one where my son bought a cat home about 1 o'clock in the morning. I'll tell you that later. But if you want a really good laugh, check out my, my um, video titled, Daughter's First Job Interview. This shit you can't make up, boo. <laughs> the shit just got real. Go check that out for a good laugh. <laughs> Word.